All right, YouTubers. It's Uncle Jay the Dipshits here. Now, I haven't put out a dip video in a while. I've been busy. I've been at work. Today, I'm sick. I stayed home because I got up and started puking. Something made me feel better. Put a dip in, and I talked to my wife. Or my girlfriend. I call her wife because, well, I love her. But this is what's going to happen. We're going to talk about some dipping. We're going to talk about some fucking West Virginia shit. And you're going to fucking sit down and listen. That's just how it's going to be. Now, in my hand today, I have Red Seal Long Cut Mint. I'm not a big fan of mint dips. I'm not a big fan of any kind of flavor dip, but I would dip anything I can get my hands on. It don't matter. Now, I will not dip fine cut. I refuse, and I hate it. I don't know how people do it, but more power to you if you do. Now, I've already got one in. But, since I dropped my can, I'm going to put another one in just so y'all can see it. Get us a little filler here. so nasty I saw a dipper the other day just because I'm not putting out videos doesn't mean I'm not watching them he does the same thing I do he, does, he puts in a dip and it makes the most god awful face now I don't know why I do it it's just a reflex I guess but as you can tell, I don't have my tripod like I used to in my old videos because the camera's like this. Shaking everywhere, but anyway, we're going to try this anyway. Hopefully, you guys like it. If you don't, I'm sorry. Red Steel Long Cut Mint. Costs maybe two seventy five to two ninety, sometimes $3 a can, depending on where you get it. Costs about $15 a roll. Now, me, anything from Red Steel, I love. Red Steel gives you 25% more. You get more than you can. You get more for your money. Red Steel lasts me a lot longer than any other can does. And a first come dipper, I would definitely recommend you start with probably their wintergreen. All Red Steel stuff is really potent. It's really strong. Because it's 100% American grown U.S. tobacco. Now, if you're spitting in a bottle, you're fucking up. You need to spit in one of these. This has been the same mud jug I bought two years ago. When I first found them. And I found mud jugs, portable spit tubes by accident when I was in high school. Looking up stuff for the military. Mud Jug sponsors the military. It's the only spittoon good enough for the U.S. Armed Forces. It's good enough for the military. It's damn good enough for me. And it's damn good enough for you. You have no excuse to spit in a bottle in a can anymore. This shit don't spill. It won't tip over. That's why it's got a weighted bottom. It's flat. It's In certain cars and trucks, it'll fit in your cup holder. Not all of them, but it's pretty sweet. Now, Mint, of course, tastes like mint, but it's not really, it's one of the stronger mints, like Skull's not that strong with mint, it's, you can still taste the regular tobacco in it, but I love Red Seal's Long Cut, because it's not fine at all, you can put anywhere. In your mouth. A lot of dippers put their dip right here in the front. I've always put mine on the side ever since I got into high school. Because when I was in middle school, I dipped in the front. I didn't really pay attention. Now in high school, they paid attention. They caught you. And eventually, they caught on to that. So I moved it up to here, to here, to here. Anywhere I could put it where they wouldn't guess. But anyway. 
I would definitely recommend you go out and buy some Red Seal anything. Just don't get their pine fed. Don't get pine fed on anything. Especially if you're a first time dipper, you will get sick as a dog. I guarantee you, you will. Now, please rate, subscribe, and comment. I loved getting comments when I was just 4K Warrior. I got tons of them. But I'm going to start putting dip videos out as much as I can. I'm going to try to get my old partner back, Baby J. I ain't talked to him in forever. It's been almost two years. But here in West Virginia, a lot of layoffs have been happening with the coal mines. You can see my coal miner shirt. Y'all need to be... Y'all tell me what y'all think about the coal mines. Do you believe in it? Do you believe it's a good job? Because I personally do. I'm very grateful I had my job. I love the company I work for. I, I couldn't imagine myself doing anything else. But the only reason I'm not able to work today, like I said before, is because I'm sick. And then throwing up. But I figured I might as well make a video. But this has been Uncle Jay with some Red Seal Mint and Mud Jug. Old Bucky. Now, go out and get yourself a Mud Jug, get yourself some Red Seal. I'll holler at you later.